Sports Blitz here in a chilly, windy Texas. Thank goodness there's no wind tonight. Thank goodness, but it's yes. always windy here. You always have the Gulf of Mexico literally just down the road. Literally, so yes. uh, it's nice that it's not windy tonight. But you know what is rolling, unlike the wind? I thought you were talking about, like, you know, Limp Biscuit rolling, or She's Like the Wind, Patrick Swayze, Dirty Dancing. I'd go, I'd go Dirty Dancing in that. Okay, I'll take that. I don't yeah, like Limp Biscuit, but okay. you know what I do like? <laughs> I like that East Chambers offense, and it was on display tonight. They it's always were on display. in control in our game of the week. And, yes, it is homecoming tonight. And as I always say, you have to win homecoming. And on the opening kick of the game, it's a pooch kick. It works to perfection. East Chambers ended up with the ball in just two plays later. Give the rock to Nolton Shelvin. And there he goes around the edge. Look at this move. Whoop, whoop. Nobody's going to stop him. 35 yards later, he is into the end zone, and EC has taken a 7-0 lead in a flash. Then it's Ja'Cory Peralt. Another shout-out to Jamie Peralt. <laughs> Looking like his pops there around the end. He's going to go into the end zone for the score for nine yards out. It's 14 to nothing, Buccaneers, and you can already feel all that momentum yep. on the green and gold side. But here comes Anawak. They're settling down. Defense going to come up with a big play. Peralt picked off by Landon. Corbett. Unfortunately, Anawak couldn't get anything going on offense, so East Chambers ends up with the ball, and we're going to pick things up when Ernest Caesar the the third. Third, takes it in for a short, short score, 21 0. How about more from the third? Perrault swinging it out to him, and he is somehow going to stay in bounds. Look at this. Look at the balance. He was in bounds. It was a good call. Touchdown there, 44 yards, 28 to nothing. Just before half, Anawak's going to get on the board, but it was all East Chambers tonight. You found him. 45-14, the Buccaneers clinch the district title in that number one seed heading into the playoffs. That's huge. No, that's very huge. And look, I mean, I thought Anawak would at least put up a little bit more of a fight in this one, but you know what, I mean, as of right now, all season long, that East Chambers offense, especially over the past month, so it's been on fire and all Gotcha. Seasons. And uh, we have just got an update.